Hello, my name is Melissa Lamaster and I'm an interior designer and architect with Dewberry. Today I will be explaining what FF&E is. In the world of construction and architecture, FF&E means furniture, fixtures, and equipment. FF&E typically encompasses all movable or easily removed objects in a building. The best way I've heard it explained is that if you turn a building upside down and shake it, FF&E is everything that would fall out. Examples of furniture include desks, chairs, tables, bookcases, and lounge furniture. Examples of fixtures include decorative lighting, lamps, artwork, and other decorative items. Examples of equipment include computers, monitors, refrigerators, copiers, and even medical equipment. Typically, FF&E is not part of the building construction contract with the general contractor. It is important to be able to differentiate FF&E from the construction package because owners often have different pools of money within the overall project budget for each one of these items. FF&E costs can be significant and must be planned for while creating the project budget. FF&E does not include built-in items like casework, shelving, or other removable building parts like HVAC, windows, toilets, and faucets. These items would be part of the general construction contract. FF&E is vital to achieving the overall goals of architectural projects and should be considered throughout the design process. For example, adequate space and the suitability of the user's needs for each room are considered by including a furniture layout during a project's design phase. Including equipment locations during the design phase is crucial to allow the engineers to place the appropriate power and data. Selecting the correct furniture, fixtures, and equipment for a project can greatly affect a space's overall functionality and aesthetics. Interior designers carefully consider the selection and placement of FF&E items to achieve the desired outcome for each space and to best support the building occupant's functionality and well-being.